started my journey. I was in rural West Texas. I, um, I was a teen mom. I, by the time I was 20, I had married my high school sweetheart. We had three children. And then I sort of woke up. <laughs> but I tell you that because I think it's important to understand that what we're talking about with Take the Lead is not just for women who are privileged or have opportunities to go to elite universities. It's really for everyone. Um, it's, we all have something to offer. Um, when I was a kid, you know, the boys were the actors, the girls were the scenery, and the help wanted ads were, were segregated by help wanted male and help wanted female. Then second wave feminism came in and smashed doors open and, and changed laws. But the problem is we didn't change the power paradigm while we were at it. And very often the first women in thought we had to be like men in order to succeed. Well, now we know what the world is really crying out for is the kind of leadership that women bring to it. So we have to ask, why has progress stalled? Well, you know, it's hard to change a culture while you're living in it. We've seen a woman first almost everything, so it's easy to believe that all the problems have been solved. But what we haven't done yet as women is to fully embrace our own power to do just that.